Hey guys, Jason from the Big Screen Store. Um, you know, a lot of our customers come in and they ask, hey, do you guys carry OLED TVs? And, you know, our answer is uh, we don't carry OLED TVs, but we do carry the best products out there, which are QLED TVs. So I want to really focus on the difference here between OLED and QLED TV products. Um, so OLED, actually Samsung is the largest manufacturer of OLED screens in the world. Uh, but they use OLED product for really what OLED is best for, which is cell phone screens. You know, most people replace a cell phone screen every two, three, four years. Sorry, not a cell phone screen, but a cell phone every two, three, four years. Um, whereas your TV, you're probably going to keep for something more like eight to 12 years. Uh, so Samsung produced a technology for um, large screen TVs, which is really much better than OLED. Uh, called QLED, um, the number of advantages and differences. Um, first being, you know, OLED uh, is not affordable in large screen sizes. And of course, we are the big screen store. Our most popular sizes are 75 inch and 82 inch TVs. You'll see a ton of 75 inch TVs lined up behind me here. Uh, this is in our Towson store. Um, we also have you know, all of our 82 inch TVs on display. Uh, but OLED products really tops out around 75 inch. Those are in the seven to $10,000 range. And we can offer 82 inch TVs starting at just around $2,000. Um, and even QLED product that starts uh, under $3,000. So huge screen sizes, bigger than what you can get with OLED. Um, and then also picture quality and performance. So OLED is an organic product. Um, so if you ever heard of with plasma TVs, that plasma TVs could burn, meaning if there was a stationary image on the screen that uh, maybe a logo or a, a ticker tape on the bottom of the screen, um, you know, lots of things are stationary. If you watch the same channel over and over again, if you play video games and there's a scoreboard, um, any of those things over time can burn into a TV screen. Uh, with QLED, there is no potential for burn-in, then Samsung actually provides a lifetime guarantee against burn-in on every QLED that they make. Um, there's a really good article that if you look at the article that's attached to this video uh, from ratings.com, and it actually shows how quickly OLED TVs degrade with use. So longevity-wise, you're looking for a TV that you're not going to change every two or three years like your cell phone. Um, QLED TVs are really the way to go there. Um, also, uh, in terms of um, brightness, you know, most people aren't putting a TV into a dedicated room for movie watching. If you truly are looking for a dedicated TV for movie watching and you want the very deepest blacks, somebody might be able to make an argument that OLED would be a better product for that. But if you're like everybody else who's putting a TV in a multi-purpose room, um, you know, a living room with lights, windows, um, you know, you're watching during the day, you have the lights on, uh, QLED TVs are, are over four times brighter than the best OLED TVs and they can be as much as 10 times brighter. Um, actually, there was a uh, episode, if, if you watch Game of Thrones, uh, towards the end there, where everybody was complaining that the scenes were so dark they couldn't even see what was going on. Except the people that own QLED TVs where they could actually see everything because the TVs are so much brighter. Um, and, you know, Um, black levels. So, you know, OLED TVs do produce great black levels. Um, a lot of people don't know that with the QLED product, they've gotten much better over the years. And even in the more entry level QLED TVs, Samsung employs their now full array backlighting technology. Basically, means that the light behind the screen works with the screen to give you almost OLED level black levels while still giving you that such much brighter picture that we talked about earlier. Um, if you're a gamer, no question, QLED is the way to go. You don't have burn-in and so many first-person shooter games and other games um, are very dark these days. And again, being able to see the detail in dark areas, you're only going to get that with a QLED product. Um, if you have any questions, give us a call, stop in and see us. Uh, but there is no question that if you are in the market for a large screen TV, for normal viewing environment, QLED is hands down the best technology to go with.